tail end of last year game against TCU and this being the first conference game next year he's sitting out this first half little misdirection end around looking for speed this is Platt Chris Platt world-class sprinter is inside the 30 finally stopped by Hassan defense but a good way to begin the drive for the Bears Brewer has to scramble got a ton of green in front of him he's got the first down and Baylor's inside the 15. That entire right side of the defense was just absolutely wide open. Brewer again with tons of time. Looks to the end zone. Caught. It's a touchdown. It's Platt. How did Chris Platt get that open in the back of the end zone? Third down at 13. Baylor shows blitz. Here they come. Down goes Bender! James Lynch, the man you were talking about a moment ago. His third sack of the season. This Baylor defense only has four sacks on the season going into this game, but they knew if they were going to get their pass rush going, it was going to be James Lynch, a guy that can play both defensive end and defensive tackle. He is a high motor. He is all over the place. And he just beats the tackle inside, makes a big play on Peyton Bender. Impressive outing so far by this Baylor defensive line against the run as well. you got to remember, they're a big part of what this offensive line is trying to do. First down and 10, play action. Charlie Brewer steps up in the pocket, wants a bunch. In the end zone, it is juggled. Touchdown, Tyquan Thornton. He juggled it, but was able to corral it in time and stay in bounds. That's the way you begin a quarter. Eric, the best part about this play is the play design. Watch him run the deep over route. Now, on the other side, you can't see the tight end runs a really good route to pull down the corner just long enough to create a throwing lane for Charlie Brewer. Not sure he was able to haul that thing in. He, he ends up securing it, but the question is, is his foot still in bounds? And does the ball move when he hits the ground? Third down at 12. Just a three-man rush. Brewer to the end zone, looking for Fleeks! Touchdown, Baylor! Well, we've talked a lot about Josh Fleeks on this drive. And he runs the deep middle route right behind the safeties. And what a throw by Charlie Brewer. We're seeing more today of what made this guy special at the end of last year and what made people really optimistic that they had found their quarterback here in Waco. And some of the throws today, look at that throw. That is an outstanding throw. Final play of the game. And Stanley's going to run. And he's out of bounds inside the 20. And that will do it for the 2018 version of Kansas and Baylor. The Baylor Bears victorious. They are now 3-1 and one on the season. From my partner Evan Moore and our entire FS1 crew, I'm Eric Collins saying so long.